Hello and welcome to your regular Friday Helium Hotspot Windows update. In today's video we'll be covering quite a lot of things, so there's a lot to unpack. We'll be covering things like the latest update from Rack, there's an update from Curlink, we have Bobcats Bash number 15, we have some new developments from Nebra and SenseCap, so stay tuned, I'll be right back and we'll get straight into it. Hey everyone, CryptoLibin here. Thanks for tuning in. If you're new around here, welcome to our little channel. First of all, the unclaimed 5 h and was claimed successfully by the rightful owner. So that has already been sorted. So once again, congratulations to Guac and Chips, who won 5 h and on our Discord giveaway. Secondly, there is another giveaway coming up where I will be giving away 70 US dollars worth of a Synchrobit voucher to one lucky winner on the 11th of August. So if you would like to enter that giveaway, make sure you head over to our Discord channel. The link is in the description below and best of luck. Please make sure you're also fully aware of all the scammers in the comment section below and you don't fall for any of these scams. Now let's get straight into things with our first Helium hotspot vendor, which is Calchip Connect for the Rack version 2 hotspot miners. They have issued an update and now I can confirm that they intend to ship the following batches in this month. So Numbat is currently being shipped for US and Canadian orders, which includes order numbers from 11,260 to 12,941. So that is currently in progress. Similarly, for the EU rack hotspot miners, Numbat is currently being shipped, and that includes orders from 16,725 to 17,425. The next batch they will start shipping once Numbat has been concluded, and hopefully this will be fairly soon, will be Orca, followed by Panda, and hopefully towards the end of this month they will ship out Quail. The next Helium hotspot vendor that we will look at is Curlink, and Curlink are manufacturing light hotspots, which are being sold by Calchip Connect as well. So finally we've had an update from Calchip Connect in relation to these Curlink miners, and they're saying that these gateways will start shipping within the next two to three weeks. So next two to three weeks means it will take us towards the end of August. So stay tuned. That is finally some good development. Again, as and when things develop further, I will let you know and I will inform you. Now let's look at the next hotspot vendor. Next, we will look at Bobcat Miner and they have announced their batch 15 details. Batch 15 will include order numbers up to 170,679 for the US frequency and that will include orders placed between the 30th of April to the 1st of May prior to 219 PDT and the EU orders cut off is going to be 165,441 which will include orders placed between the 29th of April to the 30th of April before 1040 PDT. Miners will ship next Friday, so expect the tracking shortly afterwards. There is one more thing that I would like to say about Bobcat. A lot of people have order numbers ranging in the millions. So you have a seven digit order numbers. As of the 1st of May or the 2nd of May, the order numbers are likely to jump up in batch 16 in the millions range. So do not worry, your batch will be announced even if your order numbers are in the millions range so hopefully batch 16 will in start including those order numbers and i will bring you those details on next friday when batch 16 details get announced so the next vendor we look at is synchrobit and synchrobit unfortunately have have not updated us on anything else there haven't been any developments since the last update on the 27th of july they have gone quiet however as i mentioned in my previous update you can find the link up on the right top hand corner the last update was that SB North America, who are a distributor of Syncrobit devices, had contacted their customers and advised them that shipping was delayed. So that is where we stand in terms of Syncrobit, unfortunately. Very slow. Last we heard of them, they were testing the batch in-house and there hasn't been any developments or any announcements since. So as and when things develop, I will be sure to let you know. So make sure you are subscribed to the channel and you hit that bell icon to receive those updates right so the next vendor we'll look at is nebra from the unofficial 
community Discord channel for Nebra, I can confirm that Nebra are now going to ship those 17,000 long-awaited units from the factory in the next few days, and those orders will include up to some devices for batch number four. I do apologize for my dog chomping in the background. He is just a greedy little mong, and he just doesn't leave me alone. So the next vendor we'll look at is SenseCap, and as you're probably aware, that SenseCap have been delivering their devices quite efficiently. They are now going to start selling batch four. There will be 5,000 pieces of US miners and 2,000 of the EU version. This sale is coming up and will begin in two days. So if you are interested in buying one of these devices, please make sure you monitor this. Again, this is, there is going to be a two-step process for purchasing a SenseCap device. So first of all, you will require some Helium tokens to purchase a coupon code from uh, the SenseCap website. The link for this website is in the description of this video, so make sure you check it out. The second step will be you will have to make the remainder of the payment via PayPal and thereby receive the confirmation. The next batch is going to be batch 5 and they are going to open the sale for batch 5 in 3 days time. Batch 6 sale will open in 4 days time. Batch 4 will include 7000 devices in total. Batch 5 is going to include 8000 devices in total, 5000 of the US frequency and 3000 European devices. Batch number 6 is going to include 6,000 of US frequency devices and 4,000 devices with the European frequency. Batch 4, the shipping is going to occur at the end of August. Batch 5 is going to be shipped before the end of September. And Batch 6 is going to be shipped before the end of October. So make sure that you're fully aware of these things before you actually commit yourself to purchasing one of these devices. Now let's look at Long AP and Long AP haven't said anything at all. So not much has happened there. Unfortunately, there is not much else that I can tell you about them. So let's not waste any more time on Long AP and move on to Linksdot. Now, if you happen to register an interest for a Linksdot device, Linksdot are now sending email invites to the people on that waiting list to invite them to come and purchase one of these devices. Now there is one key thing that you must remember that the shipping for Linksdot devices won't happen until late October. So that is something that you need to be fully aware of. Next we'll look at ClodPi. Now ClodPi are starting to take pre-orders tomorrow the 7th of August at 9 a.m. Indian Standard Time. So if you are wanting to purchase a ClodPi device, you're based in India, ClodPi is going to be a 45,000 rupee device. Let me know what your thoughts are, and if you are thinking of purchasing one of these ClodPi devices, best of luck, and I would love to hear your feedback on those. The next vendor we look at is going to be Pisces Miner for their outdoor helium hotspot. The only thing they have told us is this is what the miner will look like. So that's a box, so it's an outdoor device. Brilliant, but there is no other information about when they're starting the sale or pre-sale. Again, we will have to wait and see. Cotex are still somewhere in the process. Unfortunately, there are no developments there. So that's it in terms of this update. Thank you very much for tuning in. And if you're not already, please make sure you subscribe to the channel. If you found the information in this video helpful, all I ask of you is to smash that like button and make sure you hit that bell icon to stay updated. Once again, come and join us on our Discord channel, which is called The Layman's Corner. Again, link is in the description below. I would love to welcome you in our little community. We try and help each other out, and there are regular giveaways where I try and give back to our little community. So, thank you very much for tuning in. Look after yourselves, and I'll speak to you soon. And once again, my apologies for my dog chomping on the bone in the background.